Hello, I'm Carlos Casas. We are here in the exhibition Notes for a film about elephants. In this exhibition, we try to present the works that uh, lead to the realization of a film, Cemetery, a film that uses or works uh, from the myth of the elephant graveyard and works from there through uh, recalling the whole imagery of the of the myth and also uh, goes back in time to trace how this archetype idea has been uh, digested by, by the Western canon. No? In this first installation of the exhibition, we see seven uh, monitors where uh, I feature some of the archive work materials. Uh, it's selected on a series of seven uh, ways similar to the alchemical ways. And in each of, of the monitors, you see different approach technologies applied to vision and also the use of different archival uh, footage materials that are used as reference and then in certain aspects construct the and build the imagery of, of the myth in the, in the western in, in the canon so to say in the uh, use of some of these materials i've tried to deal with also different ways and, and, and technology of vision that has been used in the history of experimental film, like the use of flicker, the use of uh, overlaying materials, and uh, also new ways of approaching uh, the archive materials as a, as a kind of a, uh, distorting of the imaging, coagulation, uh, disassociation, overlaying of, of materials in all technologies that, that one to process the image in a kind of alchemical process in order to arrive to, to a new material, to a new uh, imagery. In the second room of the exhibition, we have uh, all the photographical research and uh, accumulated, sort of put together through these uh, three, four panels. In these panels, we, we have basically uh, different of the themes that the research has been organized. When I work on a project, I, I construct an archive that is based on lines and themes that in certain way collide with the idea of the project and sometimes uh, are parallel uh, narrative lines or research lines. In this case, for instance, the one of the, of the lines that for me were very important in the research is, is the discovery of, or the will uh, of using cinema and, and the cinema reference that have in, in a way populated the, the, the project and my imagery as a, as a filmmaker. No? You've got uh, uh, the cave, uh, the effect, uh, certain type of, 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 of cave paintings, some uh, experimental and expanded cinema reference that were key for me to to my development uh, as a filmmaker and artist. Uh, works like The uh, Boy of Le Favre de Sade, L'Antique Concept by Jules Woolman, La Région Centrale by Michael Snow. Uh, in the other panels that we see are also in a way frozen the ideas and concepts of, of some of the of the developments of the projects like the idea of post nature, the idea of, of, of earth that represents itself in, in other eras, in other times, in the past or in the future, the idea of black, the use of black in, 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 in the development of, of, of the idea of vision and, and guidance in, in contemporary art and modern art. And here in the last panel, uh, there is a sort of a collision of all the, the lines, of all the DNA of some of the stories that are uh, building up or running parallelly through through the main ideas of the project of the cemetery of uh, the cross species and, and even the, the, the presence of the of the elephant as an as an element of, of guidance as a as a sort of guiding species in, in the world. There is also uh, other sort of uh, thematics like the I don't speak. The Pliny as the early 
sort of understanding of, 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 of the elephant, Copernicus, uh, Ptolemaeus, the, the early examples of, of creating, uh, mapping, uh, cosmological uh, knowledge, the axis, the myth of the axis mundi, the, the, the story of Sinbad, of course, uh, Tarzan, who, what is the, in a way, the inception of the projects, the stupa as a, as a, as a monumental symbol of, a, of a beliefs, the meteorites, the sound, the guiding force of the project has been also the development of, of, of the, the, the capacity of, of, of understanding how elephants communicate and how they use sound to, 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 to communicate between herds. And then other important myths surrounding the idea of the elephant, the six blind men and the elephant as a, as a myth that it's been moved around religions. And other parallel mythologies could be the Judah Shumsher, who was the, one of the, the latest uh, uh, members of, of the royal family in Nepal that decided to abdicate and go on a spiritual exile and he decided to do that journey with an elephant and I followed that uh, storyline and it, it was an inspiration when I started working on the project. Other ones are for instance the idea of the composite elephant which is a, a figure, a reference that appears in a lot of the Mughal uh, miniatures and illuminated paintings. The figure of the elephant is composed by all other species, by other uh, members of, of, of uh, different species and also some of the, the, the deserts that have been you know, a part of, of the fascination of the project. Right?